Hey, neighborino. I have a question for you about rings. Oh, c cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah, ask away, Neptune. Neat. Okay, so I wanted to know, why does Saturn have rings? You do know I also have... You want to know why I have rings, my blue watery friend? Yes! Your rings are so beautiful! I'm kind of jelly. <laughs> Literally. What? You also have rings! Even Jupiter has rings! Only the harder to notice. Oh, Uranus, you're so funny. But are you guys even listening to me? Well, I was born with my rings. Like four billion years ago, I think. You think? Actually, that's just a theory. But more recent studies suggest that your rings may have originated from a moon that got too close to you. So close that gravity destroyed it. This moon's debris is what probably made your rings. W what? They even say this whole moon destruction thing may have been going on for billions of years with other moons that formed previous rings. I c c killed my m m moons Well, uh, I mean, it, it, it's just a theory. It's not a hundred percent certain. I killed my moons! I have about 27 moons. I could try to force them to crash into me. <laughs> Hello, my beautiful moons. Hi, Diane. It's Dione. Hello, mime. Mimes. My name's Mimes. Hello, moon whose name sounds like salad in Spanish. Hey, Enceladus sounds nothing like... Okay, it kinda does. And hello to everyone else. Wait, where's Titan? Titan? Titan! He somehow remembers that name. Titan! Where have you been? Hey, Saturn. J just gazing at the stars. Come on now! I'm gathering all my 83 moons. There's something I need to discuss with all of you. Okay, everyone is here. I'm Saturn. We know who uh, you are. Right, so this is awkward, but I just found out that my beautiful rings were made from the corpses of old moons. <gasps> is he serious? Why is he telling us this? I didn't know this was happening, I swear. I can't help being one of the biggest planets of the solar system and you being my tiny moons. However, I believe everyone deserves a second chance. So if I can have your forgiveness, we can all get along and I'll never consume you all. So we either forgive you or you kill us? Is that the choice? Wait, I, I didn't mean it like that, Ensalada. My name's Ensalada. Guys, that's enough. Of course we forgive you, Saturn. Oh, thank you, Titan. You're the best. Oh, and so is everyone else. Phew, that's a load on Of course it's easy for you to forgive him, huh? You being the favorite. What can we do? We're just moons. Only because we orbit Saturn. Guys, let's just... Let's just go. Do I know you? What, are you that crazy planet that lives in the asteroid belt? What? Uh, no, I'm not a planet. I'm Titan, Saturn's moon. You're a moon? Ha! <laughs> no way! Why'd you say that? You look pretty big for being a moon. I mean, you're way bigger than Pluto. You may be even bigger than Mercury. <laughs> well, I don't know about that. You're just- Hold on, is that an atmosphere? Oh, I'd kill for one of those. Hey, uh, can you- Yes, sorry. Too much. So, why are you here? I just wanted to meet you. You're Earth's moon, after all. I see. You're interested in the Earth? I mean, who isn't? He has the conditions to sustain life. He has liquid water. I guess he's unique. But we all are in our own way. I believe every one of Can you introduce me to the Earth? Please? Won't Saturn notice you're gone? Saturn has 83 moons. It'll take him a while. Hmm. Well, all right. I'll see what I can do. Thanks! Ugh, oh, you're the best. Let's stay in touch! Is he really a moon? Hey, Earth. Moon, you know what I've said about interrupting my card games. Yeah, sorry. Uh, there's someone who wants to meet you. Hello, Mr. Earth. It's an honor. I came here to- Whoa! 
Are you a new planet? I've never seen you before. Why does everyone think I'm a pla- No, I'm a moon named Titan. Hey, I think I've seen you from afar. You're Saturn's favorite moon, right? What did he call you? He's Middle Earth? Wait, what? What's up with that name? Oh, it's because Titan's Mountains are named after famous mountains from the Lord of the Rings books. Oh, I, for a moment I thought you were implying he was- But it's also because you're both made of rock, have atmospheres, volcanoes- what, Volcanoes? Isn't he like very cold? Ice volcanoes. Oh, that sounds way cooler! What? No! How is ice cooler than lava? Well, it literally is. But anyways, you both also have lakes and rivers. Nobody else does, for what I know. <laughs> so? Does he have an ocean, huh? Under his surface. And not just any ocean, liquid water. So it's possible he could sustain life- Stop! Don't say it! He's just a moon, okay? We're nothing alike. Oh, come on, don't be rude. No! Moons should know their place. Keep saying silly things like this and you'll make them think they can become planets like us! Hey, so... Titan! What's up? I came here to meet you. Uh-huh. And? Any thoughts? Disappointed. Well, that was rude! Hey, Mars. You got a bad hand going there, old buddy? Shut up. Whoa! Okay. Did you hear that, Moon? Yes. He told you to shut up. Hey, why is everyone being rude to me today? We're being rude? Earth, you just insulted Saturn's moons, and all moons for that matter. What did I say? That moon should know their place. I, uh, yes, that may have come out wrong. But what I meant is that you think you're better than the moons. In fact, you think you're better than the rest of us, don't you? Well, I have life, don't I? Seriously, Here we go. Dude, as you're arrogant as always. You're becoming all you just as unlikable no, as Venus. That's so hard? Guys, I... I can't help being special. Earth, having life doesn't make you special. Oh, please, elaborate. If you multiply the rate of star formations with a fraction of stars that may have planets, and then multiply that with the number of planets that could sustain life, and then that with the average lifetime of a planet, we get... Uh, Jupiter? At minimum. 1.4 billion planets potentially like you in our galaxy, Earth. But I... I work so hard. I put up with so much to be a, a, a good home for my Earthlings. But I'm not... special? The universe is big. There's at least two of everything. Sorry. You know what could really make you special? If you stop being so arrogant and apologize to Titan. And if I don't? Then you can play solitaire, dude. Oh, I... I get it now. Ugh. Hey, bruh. What's up? Okay, what's your angle? No angle. Just vibing, uh... Best friend? Earth, while I'm flattered, Mars is your best friend. Well, not anymore. Him and the moon are forcing me to apologize because I think moons are not as cool as planets. Huh. I mean... Is that the whole story? Moon should know their place. Pretty much. Then, I mean, who cares? Exactly! Oh, I was this close to apologizing, but you made me reconsider things, best friend. Can you not call me that? It's pretty awkward. Earth, don't do this. What do you want, Mercury? To stop whatever this is. You'll just end up reinforcing each other's bad traits. Bad traits? Hey, the Earth and I are neighbor planets. In fact, why shouldn't we be friends? We share almost the same size, mass, density, and volume. Some even believe we were formed at the same time. I'm basically Earth 2.0. Pfft. Yeah, should I state the obvious? You know what, Mercury? If you're gonna tell Venus for the hundredth time that he can't have life, then save it. Come on, Venus. Let's go. Yeah! Let's go, best friend! Okay, you're right, that's pretty awkward.